to this 40 minute cardio mix and lower body core strength training workout. This is the third video in the Fit and Firm series. Please preview this entire video before doing it so you're familiar with some of the exercises. You're gonna run through seven circuits. Each circuit, you have five exercises and each exercise is one minute long. We are going to push, we are going to work hard and I'm gonna really challenge your cardio endurance and your strength. For this workout, you're gonna want some sort of slide board. If you have a skateboard, that's okay. This is a planter with wheels. And if you don't have it, no big deal. I want resist band tubing. I don't care if your tubing looks like this or if it looks like this with handles. I want a set of hand weights. I have weights here and I have my Bowflex weights. I also want a mat stability ball and step bend. Have all the equipment by your side. My name is Angie, Angie Fitness TV. Let's go. All right, circuit one, jog. One minute of jogging. You are in circuit one. You have five exercises. We're gonna start with cardio to warm it up. Right here. If you prefer to march, march it guys. This is your workout, so I need you to modify according to your body and where you're at. Hup, give me some little hammer curls with it. Gotta warm it up. Yeah, I'm gonna really challenge us today. We're gonna work cardio, vascular endurance, lower body, quad, glute, hamstring, calf and core you're going to really work core stability today i promise you'll thank me tomorrow Woo! for this workout side to side right here hop it side to side Woo! this is the third video in the fit and firm series. Got some good music. Motivating music. It's gonna really guide us. Boom. Big smile on your face. We have a lot of work to get through today. We are energized. We are strong. We are powerful. Come on. Changing lives one day at a time. Come on, Hup. I want that music to drive. Boom. Four, three, give me butt kickers. I don't care what leg. Yeah, arms, pull those arms back. Elbows back, I want to warm up that upper cervical and thoracic. Kick your heel to your butt, as fast or as slow as you want to go. Hup. This is your third exercise of five. These circuits go fast. That's why I recommend you preview the whole workout before you do it the first time through. So you have an idea of what weight you want and what the exercises look like. Give me knees, arms up and down. Right here, push. Now remember, you can go like this to modify to keep it low. From the side. Give me those arms. I have a timer right in front of us. So I know each exercise I'm doing is one minute. Between each circuit, 
We have 30 seconds of active recovery. Come on, push. Four, three, jack, jack, jack. Low impact, right here. Yeah. Breathe it through. Now listen to me. For circuit two, you're gonna want medium to heavy weight for quad work. Give me 30 seconds. Y'all should be warm. Come on, push. 15 seconds. And you get 30 seconds active recovery before we go into circuit two. We're gonna work those quads in circuit two. March, any way you want. Step touch. 30 seconds, active recovery. Now listen, for circuit two, you're gonna want heavy weights. We're gonna start with a full squat. I'm gonna have 15 pounds. We're gonna go slow and controlled. Go grab your weights. I'll meet you for circuit two. All right. All right, guys. Circuit two right here. Put the weights on your shoulders. Wide stance. Eat out, down, two, up, two, down, two, up, two. These are full squats. Feet are in external rotation. Yeah. Down. Two, everything's gonna be a slow count because we're working with heavy weight. Come on. Woo, baby! Each exercise is one minute. Yeah? Wow, you are officially in circuit two. This is exercise one of five. You can push through, you can do it. I have no repeat exercises. Come on, let's go. You're gonna give me one more. All right, put one, actually keep your weight. We're gonna side split squat, side, in. Side split squat, come in, heavy weight. Side split squat, come in, out, two, into keep that beat when you work with heavier weight i want that control go heavier with your weights if you can side split squat come on out two in two working gluteus medius and hip abductors Woo! working with 15 pounds Next time, I'm gonna work with 20. Come on. Oh, couple more. One more, we go to that other side. All right, other side. Out, two, in, two. Exercise three of five. Come on, push. Work that heavy weight. That's how we get muscle gains. That's how we grow. That's how we sculpt. That's how we strengthen. Don't stay with light weight. Challenge yourself. Come on, again. Woo! I'm feeling it. Couple more. All right, come up. All right, squat down to rear lunge, alternating. Ready? 
go. Down, two, up, two. Right leg. Down, two, up, two. Let's go. Down, two, up, two. Down, two, up, two. Down, two, up, two. Rear, lunge, two by two. That's single. Down, up, back. Down, back. Squat, rear lunge. Squat, rear lunge. Squat, rear lunge. Squat. Rear lunge. Squat. Pushing those heavy weights. Hup. One more each side. All right, calf raises. Up on your toes. All right, two choices. Weights can come here. Up on your toes. Calf raises. Come on. 40 seconds, lift, lower, lift, lower. Woo! Come on. You get 30 seconds of active recovery in 30 seconds. Now, your metabolic burn, calorie burn, should be high because you're pushing heavier weights and that keeps that heart rate higher because you're pushing at a hard intensity. Put your weights up, march it, 30 seconds recovery. Small sips of water. You are getting ready to go into circuit three. It's all about steady cardio. We will be doing kickboxing. Don't worry. It will be simple, basic, and easy to follow kickboxing that gets your heart rate up. Yeah, you're not gonna worry about circuit three. You're gonna worry about pushing. So give me small, take small sips of water. I'll see you for circuit three. Jab cross with the knee, jab cross one knee. Welcome to circuit three. You're in your cardio, push. Jab cross one knee. Jab, cross, and knee. Woo! This is exercise one of five. Give me that intensity. Push. Come on. Jab, cross, and a knee. One, two, three, and four. Push. Steady cardio here. Four, three, two. Jump rope here. Turn to the left. Jab, cross, one knee. And four, three, jab, cross, knee. Other side. What you do to one side, you must do to the other side. Come on, jab, cross, and push. Jab, cross, one knee. Woo! Come on, jab, cross, and smash that knee. You can slow it down if you need to, by all means. Jab, cross, and a knee. Two more. Last one. Jump rope. You're gonna jack with the jab. Actually, right leg. Right leg up and back. Up, back. Hands, guard position. Right leg up and back. At that jab, cross. Jab, cross. Right leg up and back. Jab, cross. Two more exercises and we're moving on to circuit four out of seven.
That right foot is going forward and back. Forward, back. Jab, cross. Four, three, jump rope, my friends. Left leg, forward and back. There we go. Get in that position. Left leg forward, back. Last two exercises. Now, jab, cross. Come on. One more exercise to push. You get active recovery. I know you can do it. Left foot front back, front back. Four, three. Two, jump rope, last minute. Now heels, jump rope. Come on, keep that jump rope. Both feet, jump rope. 45 seconds, we get a break. Heel jump rope. Both feet, jump rope. Now we're gonna start on that left heel, jump rope. Go. Both feet, jump rope. You're gonna start, left heel, jump rope. Ready, go. Both feet, last time. Come on. March any way you want. 30 seconds recovery. Step touch. Let's talk about circuit four. It's all about the hamstrings and the glutes. We're gonna begin with our deadlift. You're gonna want two heavy weights. You're also gonna want your slide board. 10 seconds, walk around the room, get your equipment, small sips of water, and meet me back for circuit four. All right, guys, circuit four. All about the hamstrings. I have 20 pounds each hand. Deadlift, here we go. Down, two, up, two. Hinge from the hip, nice neutral back. Shoulders back. Sit back in your heels. Back, two, up, two. If that's too fast, go slower. One minute, each exercise. Hinge, hip. Imagine you have a doll rod in the middle of your back. Hinge, hip. Back is in neutral position. Shoulders are back. You're gonna press up through your heels to get that gluteus maximus. Two more, two more. You're gonna get that slide board. If you don't have one, you're just gonna rear lunge. Put your weights up right here. All right, get your slide board. I have a plan. Okay, what we're gonna do, anterior rear lunge. Looks like this, back, two, up, two, slide it back, touch the ground, up, two, yeah, a lot of balance, dynamic balance, core stability, woo, oh, go down, it's a rear lunge, if you have a small skateboard, that's just as good, or if you have gliders, that's fine. If not, just rear lunge. Anterior rear lunge. I bought this at Home Depot for like $9. One more. Other leg. All right, are you ready? Two by two, here we go. Back, two, up, 
two, back. Make sure you're not doing that same leg. Back, two, woo. A lot of dynamic core stability balance training, along with working hamstring and glutes. You get like a five for one. Come on, push. Our next exercise, you're gonna want heavy weights. We're gonna do deadlift, single stiff leg. Don't worry, I'll show you. I'm gonna grab for my 20s. One more. Put that slider away. Grab your heavy weight. All right. One leg in front, one leg in back. Your front leg is a stiff leg. Back heel is up, down, two, up, two, down, two, up. Let me go from the side. Deadlift, woo, single, stiff leg. Now, if you can't maintain straight leg like me, you're gonna bend at the knee. Now, remember you have a dowel rod in the center of your spine. Hip hinge. One more. Come up, put a bend in the knee if the stiff leg is too much. Other leg back. You're up on your heel with your right leg. Stiff leg with the front, hip hinge, two by two. Deadlift, single stiff leg. Oh, this is it. I have 20 pounds in my hand. I'm trying to hip hinge, shoulder blades back, neutral spine. Come on. Circuit four is almost done. Two more, two more. Ugh. Challenge your body, work it differently. Come up. Now, if you don't like that at all, you would just do a regular deadlift. March. Deep breath in. We're getting ready to go into circuit five cardio. Grab your step bench. One riser if you have it. If not, no step bench is required. Another deep breath in, small sips of water. So it's important you challenge your body in new ways you're not used to working. Are you ready? I'll meet you back. Step bench, no riser or one riser. All right, circuit five. We're gonna hop it up and down. 45 seconds of work, 15 off, let's go. Up. This is your hit interval. Don't worry if you don't have a step bench. Hop it forward and back. 45 seconds of hard work. 15 seconds recovery. Five exercises in circuit five. 15 seconds. Hop it up, hop it down. Two more. March. 15 seconds recovery. Next one. While you're recovering, watch me. Hop it up with the knee. Touch a bench. Are you ready? 45 seconds of work. Exercise two of five. Hop it up. Pop it down. Push. Fifteen seconds. Work through it. Last five. March, 
Other side. Recover. Are you ready? 45 seconds of work. Exercise three to five. Cardio hit. In a row, circuit five. You can do anything for 45 seconds. Last 15. Pop it up, pop it down. One more. 15 seconds recovery. Two more exercises. Hop out wide, hop in, hop in center. Hop out wide. Hop in center, hop out wide, here we go. In, out, out, in, in, out, out, in. Again, in, out, out, in, in, out, out, in. Two more. Last time. March. One more exercise. All right. Over the bench and back. You're going to add that hop. Five seconds. Two. Go. Now touch. Pop it over, touch it back. This is it for circuit five. Hop it over, top it back, tap it back. Last 10 seconds. One more. March, 30 seconds. Active recovery, let's talk. Done with circuit five. Circuit six, hamstring, quad, glute. You're gonna need a mat. You're gonna need. I'm just trying to breathe, people. You're gonna need your stability ball. You're gonna want your band. You're gonna want one weight. Mat, band, stability ball, one heavy weight. I'll be grabbing one 20 pound weight. Put your step bench up. Get the rest ready. Let's move on to circuit six. Okay, circuit six, grab your resistor band. Put it underneath your left leg, and we're going to rear lunge and come up. Hands right by your shoulders, back. Back, two, up two, if you like that beat. Back, two, up two. I'm gonna do it two more times. Come on, one more. Let's do one more, two by two. Now single it, if you want, down. Don't worry about the beat of the music. Come on, you are in circuit six. Hamstring, quad, and glute. Knee, ankle alignment. One more. Put it underneath your right leg. Lift, right by your shoulders. Back, two, up, two. Back, two, up, two. Nice, slow and controlled. Woo! Couple more. 
you want to single, by all means single. One more. Now go faster, but don't stay to the beat. Here's my own beat I'm comfortable with. Back and up. Now our next exercise, we're gonna want medium, one medium to heavy weight. We're coming on our knees. If you need to pad your knees, do so. Do a squat if you don't like these next exercises. Remember, I said you need to challenge your body. Okay, put that off to the side. I'm gonna grab a 15 right here. Kneeling squats, have the weight by your side. Now, it looks like this, down and up to neutral. You have a forward bend, heels to your butt. Working back, extension, and glute work. Right here, kneeling squat bend. Come up to neutral alignment, not hyperextension. So come up into a tall neutral spine. Two more. Working quads and glutes. One more. Okay. I'm going to go for no weight because my quads are shaking. Quad kneeling. Back and up. Neutral spine and up. Right here. If you can carry a weight, by all means, carry a weight. Oh, no. I don't do these enough. So you go back for two, up for two. Look, neutral spine. If I had a rod on my back, nice and neutral. My quads are doing the work. Quad kneeling squat right here. One more. You're going to grab that stability ball right now. All right, we're going to bridge lateral raise. So right here, grab your resist band, wrap it around, cross it, have even distance, cross it. Now when you go up in your bridge, you lift your arms to the side, right here. Bridge, lateral raise on the ball. Working dynamic stability. Working your lats, working your glutes, working your back extensors, and your core, st yeah, core stabilizers. Come on. I'm gonna do this for a minute and a half because it's so good for us. And then we're gonna put our equipment away and we're gonna move on to core using the planter or your skateboard or glider and the stability ball. 15 seconds, work that dynamic stability, those core stabilizing muscles as you lift. You're working, as your arms go out to the side, you're working your latissimus dorsi. And release. Yeah, hard, right? The more you do, you get better. All right, for circuit seven, your ball and your planter. Put all your equipment away and I'll see you for our final circuit seven core. Guys, our final circuit. We were, really worked our lower body in new ways today. So I'm really challenging us. Now you have the ball in between both legs. Lift, lower, up, two, down, two. So you're on your forearms. Now a lot of stabilizing muscles having to work here. Side right hold, woo. 
Let's go up, two, down, two, up, two, down, two. Again, up, two, down, two, up, two, down, two, up, two, down, two, up, two, down, two. Again, up, two, down, two. Last time. Switch sides very quickly. Woo! Up, two, down. Yeah, you got to really get it. You can kickstand your top hand if you need it or try. I'm just sweaty as heck and my ball doesn't want to stay in between my legs because I'm so sweaty. Up, two, down, two. Up, two, down, two. Up, two, down, two. Two more. All right, grab your ball right here. Are you ready? We're gonna slide out for two, in for two. Here we go. Out, two, in, two. We're done with the stability ball after this. We're gonna grab our planter slider or your gliders. Let's hold it. Engage that core. Last two exercises. Are you ready? Put that ball off to the side. All right, grab your slider. I'm gonna work your latissimus dorsi and I'm going to work our core. So come on up into a plank. One hand, up, two, back, two, up. Slide it up and back. You're in that plank. Nice flat back. One hand is sliding that slider forward and back. Working your core, stabilizing muscles, 15 seconds. Work that latissimus dorsi when your arm slides out and comes back. Take a break, roll those wrists, set up your plank, hands under your shoulders, feet can be hip width apart, other hand slide forward and back, this is it. Stretch after this. Slide it forward and back. Last 30 seconds, you're done. Woo, keep going. Last 15. And done. Woo, sit back in child's pose. Butt to your heels, arms over. Awesome, awesome workout. I introduced you to a lot of new exercises, so become familiar with them. Challenge your body, grow your body. If you don't like to exercise, that's okay. Switch it with one you like. 
Let's cool it down. Deep breath in. And a nice exhale. One more time, people. We got to stretch it. Deep breath in. And exhale. All right. I'm getting my mat out of the way. All right. Let's just come up and over. Now let's talk. Those kneeling exercises for quads, yeah, they were hard. You saw they were hard for me. But the more you do this workout, the stronger you get. If I move too fast, slow it down. Go at your own pace. Modify. Make this workout work for you. You are strong. You are. Challenge your body to grow. Reach across. Stay with me for this quick stretch. Other side. All right, take it to one side. Let's get that nice inner thigh adductor stretch. Be sure you try my other videos in this fit and firm series. I work all different muscles Woo, differently. Each video is absolutely 100% different. Other side. So this fit and firm series is a great way to shake up your workout Really take your strength training and your cardio to that next level, people. All right, take it up. Toes to the ceiling, sit back. I am shaking. We worked hard. I worked hard. You saw me struggle. Real life workout for real people. We're not fitness models, we're just real people. Trying to get cardiovascular heart healthy and really strengthen these muscles. Switch other side. A big smile on your face. We pushed it, guys. We worked seven circuits. Are you ready? Grab behind. Ooh. Grab onto a wall if you need to. Other leg. Be sure to comment, guys. Subscribe. Let me know what you thought. Let me know what you think of this Fit and Firm series. Are you doing it? Are you growing? Are you changing? Are you getting stronger? Deep breath in. And a nice exhale. One more time. Deep breath in. And exhale. Come here. Come here. Look. You see the sweat? You can't make this up. Real life workout. Real people. Thumbs up. Come here. Come here. High five. Hey, one more. Come here, come here. High five. I'll see you for our next workout together.